ABB's Robot Studio provides many tools and features which help in quick and easy debugging of rapid code. One such feature is the Rapid Watch Window. During program execution, you can use the Rapid Watch Window to view the values of selected variables and I.O. signals in real time. You can drag and drop selected variables or I.O. signals to the Rapid Watch Window to view them. By default, during program execution, the values of the variables are automatically refreshed in the watch window every two seconds. You can also manually refresh the values. You can follow the program execution by following the program pointer, which is the yellow arrow. The program pointer indicates the line of code that is currently executing. Using the commands in the Program Pointer menu, you can also set the Program Pointer to the location of the cursor, or to a routine, or to the main, and then start program execution from that point. The Rapid Editor window automatically scrolls according to the movements of the Program Pointer. The Test and Debug group of commands allows you different program execution options that help with debugging the code. For instance, you can choose Step In to start and execute into a routine, but stop at the beginning of the routine. You can choose Step Over to execute one statement in a normal task. And you can choose Step Out to execute all remaining statements in a current routine. The execution stops after the call to the current routine. Through the Rapid Watch window, you can also edit the values of the variables during program execution and also when the controller is stopped. For instance, in this particular Rapid program, there are three program execution flows depending on the value of the variable, pallid item count. As part of debugging the code, you can execute different flows by changing the value of this variable in the Rapid Watch window. The value of the variable is updated in the Rapid Watch window as the program executes. Changing the value again executes a different flow. You can also set breakpoints in the code. You can use the toggle breakpoint command to add or remove a breakpoint at the cursor. Program execution stops at the breakpoints. Using the rapid window and properly placed breakpoints, you can observe the changes in critical variables. As you see, the debugging features of Robot Studio provide efficient and effective ways of identifying, analyzing, and resolving potential issues with your robot program. In short, Robot Studio helps you get the production going.